previously. I can't believe this. Is this is this the third time we've played this bot? This is three, right? I'm not crazy. This is three times we've played this bot on Master Duel Masochist. Wait! We win! No, I don't have enough plants! I'm one off! What is a deck? A collection of cards that is an extension of the player? A tool used to win tournaments? A reflection of oneself? What gives a deck meaning? The individual cards? The number of victories? Or what about the will to never give up? Does a deck inherently possess meaning? Or do we as players assign meaning to the deck? Can we create meaning from nothing? What if we created a new Master Duel account, ignored the starter decks, and restricted the account to the minimum amount of Master Packs possible to create a legal, although not necessarily playable deck of 40 main deck cards and throw ourselves into ranked? If we somehow miraculously defeat an opponent, we can upgrade our deck with one additional Master Pack. Can we achieve something like this in Master Duel that only a masochist would try? I guess there's only one way to find out. This is Master Duel Masochist. Two legacy packs, we'll take it. But before that, of course, we have one of the finest master packs you've ever seen. It is actually one of the finest master packs we've ever seen. All right. Channeling Weevil Underwood for this one. Lucius the Shadow Vessel. Submarine Roid, very funny. That goes to Falcos. Amethyst Cat, Datatron, Vampire Sorcerer. Okay, come on, come on. That's so bad, we can't play this. <laughs> two for two. So bad, so bad. All right, let's open the Legacy Packs. Maybe we'll do better. Oh, I have three, I must have missed one. Changer Synchron Photon Generator Unit for the Cyber Laser Dragon we're never going to summon. Cockadoodle do. This thing actually isn't the worst, sadly. It's really funny. When Gage, Joseph, and uh, Coder were all here for the YCS, we were talking about this exact card. Uh, this card sucks, by the way, but it's just funny that this randomly showed up. All right, Legacy Pack, please. Fatal Abacus. Infected Mail. Isn't this... No, okay. I saw it because it was infected. I thought it had something to do with insects, but uh, it does not. This deck again. All monster hand again, by the way. It's almost impressive. Master picked hearse is insane. How exactly am I beating a Seeger? I guess I can just time breaker it. They know they're going first, right? This seems ambitious. Still a Sidra in hand too. I was expecting like cybernetic overflow if they were gonna do that, but that just seems insane to me. Okay, that's actually really good. Okay, so the problem is Seeger's any machine, right? Yeah, it's one machine you control. Okay, so that's annoying. So what I actually have to do is, I'm gonna have to hope I don't die, which is, considering a Sidra, probably impossible, but. God, if I don't get rid of Rampage actually, they can just send and do it again? Yeah, I actually have to get rid of Rampage. 
Because they can just dump two, attack for 63. Then I'm like, for sure dead. Seeger, I think if it does the effect, there's like no damage. I just got fucking Ghost Ogred. Are you kidding me? What is going to happen? Both it and this card from your field until the next standby phase. This isn't going to do what I want. Literally had Ghost Ogre. That is insane. So it's not going to banish? Uh, okay. Well, we're basically dead. They just have to go Seeger, Pump, Attack, this, Send 2, get to 63, and then any other monster kills me. Yep. Naster pitched the other Sidra, probably. Bring back Sidra. Uh, pump. Attack. Wait. Oh! <gasps> I'm alive! Wait. I'm not alive! Never mind! <laughs> I thought it was neither player takes damage. Maybe it's from the, the Seeger exactly. At least we have removal. Oh god, we're going first? Okay. I still never know what the correct send is here. I just like sending Vayne. I feel like if they summon a guy and have all spells, then like Vayne stopping two of them is pretty good. Sure. Don't do that. I really feel like I should banish that. I'll let them sink and then I'll banish the thing. I might just be dead, but we'll see. Okay. Are they gonna try like linking here or some shit? All right, it might be too late for this, but we'll see. Um, I hope they just clear these. At this point, it's probably just getting rid of Yukiona, but we'll see. Aether off the top would be nice. That's pretty good, too. Okay. That sucks. Yep. Unizombie, dump Mizuki, go to level four. Mizuki, resurrect. Ah, oh, they have another one. Bring that back, yep. Royal? Well, unfortunately, 
I've got to do this now. Uh, they're probably just going to link off this Yukiona for the re the Link 4 one. They might just do something with this Unizombie anyway. So, like, honestly, whatever I banish may not even matter here. It's probably not going to matter. I'll just go after that. Second Mizuki. We're probably dead. 19. Hey, we have this card. Oh, we're probably dead. Are they going to go up into like the level 11 thing? Make the 7, make the 11, banish Mizuki, summon the Link 2, kill me. Yeah, we're, we're, we're dead. think it really mattered that with that banish honestly solitaire like turned on the whole deck i see their name is skull servant it'd be very funny if they were in fact actually playing skull servants they could be playing skull servant they could be playing skull servant i doubt it but they could be playing skull servant there is a chance I don't think Skull Servant's a level one fire, but. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> they are not playing Skull Servant. Okay. We can work with this. The only reason I'm staying is because we have a Gamma Seal. That is the only reason we are staying. Oh, what the hell? They're actually playing that? That is so annoying that they're on this because this card actually stops us from hitting with Solitary Sword. That is so irritating. Oh my god. They just had a second one? No, it was long one. Okay. Oh, they didn't even make Baron. Doesn't this do something when it's banished? All right. His battle prowess is unmatched. I can only imagine this being like in the anime where the sword changes to the solitary sword. How could this have happened? <laughs> you gotta be fucking kidding me. <laughs> Not the solitary sword. <laughs> We're ruined. <laughs> it's over. It's over. Oh my god. <laughs> Highest value solitary sword by the We're literally just pressing buttons. I'm going to lose to pressing buttons. I I actually can't believe I'm going to say this. I think I can still win. Sometimes you're just good. I don't I don't know what to say. Sometimes you're just good.
at least it was all chainable. But I would have preferred to, like, kill this Gamma Seal. Monster! Goki Rescorpio off the top. Oh! <gasps> That's good, too! Behold! The giant ball game! His battle prowess is unmatched! <laughs> There's no way we win this. There's zero chance we win this. Pass. 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 Sometimes you're just better. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Please! Please! If they... I I'm gonna be so... Behold the power of incense! <laughs> it has protection. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Oh my god. <laughs> it doesn't matter. All right, let's try again. Okay. Hold up. I think I just... I, I'm going to take this one. I want to see if there's any way to get this bigger. It's terrible. Maybe they won't summon. Maybe they'll just attack. I stand corrected. All right. <sighs> We tried. That was the least deserved loss we've ever had. I probably agree with that. All right, we got lots of removal on this hand. I thought they were going to be on blue eyes, but would blue eyes? I guess they would play extra. I, I stand corrected. Okay, Ice Dragon's Prison can go pretty hard in this matchup. And funny enough, Armored B can kill Alternative, so that's hilarious that that even works. I have never seen this card in my life. Well, thankfully, Ice Dragon's Prison doesn't target. So we're actually okay for now. If they go double Chaos Max, we're in trouble. Okay. So, here's what I want to do. We're going to go Dianea, kill Manju... Second main. We're going to Parasomnia Pillow the alternative. Set three. End phase resolve pillow. Get our 3,000 attack token. And then next turn... We have Ice Dragon's Prison to deal with Chaos Max. Oh, High Ritual Arc gets rid of it. Well, that's even better then, because then we can take out the other one. Because they grabbed uh, Advanced Ritual Art. What was the point of that then? I'm so confused. And we know their hand is, they drew another alternative. Oh, no, they got rid of the blue eyes when they high ritual arted. 
So all we know that they have is is advanced ritual art. With certainty. Man, I would kill for effect negation right now, but unfortunately we don't have it. All right. So they're going to get Chaos Max here. They have ARA plus Chaos Max, which is fine. It's fine. This is actually better because I can floodgate the Chaos Max and not, I don't have to waste my Ice Dragon's Prison. Man, it is so nice having outs to Chaos Max now. We can't win here, can we? No, I don't think so. I could humiliate them and have Maneater Bug hit over the Chaos Max. That'd be kind of funny. <laughs> Highest value Maneater Bug of all time. Did they DC? <laughs> oh, no, they're back. They're back. I think I would DC if I uh, had my Chaos Max lose to a Maneater bug, but that's just me. Just like we drew it up. One double Chaos Max in hand. Man, who would have thought that many episodes ago we would have had the ability to out a Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon? Twice! Twice! Oh, you fool. You absolute buffoon! Does that have to be the same type? Same type, okay. Uh, I'm not gonna do it to the original Blue Eyes. I like the original Blue Eyes too much. It's really interesting that the Parasomnia token inherits the typing. So, like, I could have banished the token instead and kept that other blue eyes, which is arguably better. Because then it's, like, less vulnerable because of the, the equip spell. Man, this deck has come so far. All right. Uh, I'm not afraid of anything. Yeah! Clean, clean victory, clean victory. Holy shit. Five legacy tickets, oh my God. That's gotta be a record. Wow, that was, that was such a clean win. I mean, it's still Chaos Max, right? But still. Oh! <gasps> It's an insect! Special summon a lever four lower insect from hand or grave! It's an insect! It's kind of playable! <laughs> oh man, that weevil jacket's looking more and more tempting by the second. Holy shit. That's that's pretty cool. Oh! Oh wait, we already have safe zone. Why am I getting excited? We played that before. It's kind of cool that we have two of them, funny enough. Gem Knight Amber, Rainbow Refraction. That's a Rainbow Dragon card. Roaring Earth. That's a Beast Synergy. Cubic, Dragon's Bind. Okay, please. Witchcrafter Hain, unfortunate. All right. We have five legacy tickets to open. That's insane. Five at once. I didn't ever think we were gonna beat four, but here we are. Archfiend Interceptor. Hanewada. In case the next burn event rolls around. Perfect. Plesios is okay. Backlinker. Ah. I've seen worse cards. I've seen worse cards. Psychic Jumper. Ocelo Hero. 
Come on. I mean, it's a plant. An intelligent palm tree that drops a hail of rock-hard coconuts on its enemies. Gotta love old Yu-Gi-Oh. Little Wingard. Come on, be something good in the end. Be something good in the end. <laughs> Shoutouts to Jank for this one. Magic Planter's kind of cool. All right. Well, that sucked. Is Camellia on special? Oh my god, we can giant ball game Camellia to trigger it again? That's so good. Giant ball game just gets better and better each time I read it. That's crazy. Our old nemesis. You know what I just realized? Paleozoic Dynamicious is an out to Eternal Soul. So we actually have two outs to that card now because it's just anything face up. That's pretty sick. All right, let's whiff that circle. Gross. When am I getting Harpy's Feather Duster in a, a Master Pack or a Legacy Pack? That'd be nice. All right, I need a miracle. It's just if it's destroyed at all, it's irritating. Probably should have summoned the ogre with this, but I think it was still just going to result in the same situation. I just need to live a turn. I'm just trying to live a turn. Okay. I think I should be able to survive. I'm just hoping I can wall off and hope that I draw Dust Tornado or Dynamicious and I just clear Eternal Soul and we're fine. It's extremely optimistic, but there is a chance. Oh, now we're just... Well, eh, Dino Mistress can still banish. Dino Mistress still banishes. Oh, they can't target. Never mind. It targets. We're dead. That's just like... That's just like the lock. You know, any hand that I see Ice Dragon's Prison, I feel like is a winnable hand. Please whiff. Please whiff, if this is all you're doing. Yeah, best card, baby, best card. Does absolutely nothing. All right, let's get it. That just got me one eighth closer to winning the game. That's pretty good. Which effect did they use? Special summon Dark Magician? That's very fucking funny. Do I just take it? Fuck. <laughs> sure. No! They already had it! I got outplayed. Well, they were gonna summon it anyway. So, like, it didn't really matter. Ah, uh, my suprex. No!
They didn't banish. Did it, like, miss the timing or something? Oh, it's weird. Skill Drain Eternal Soul Circle. That is so infuriating. This is just so annoying. I can Gamma Seal it, but then, like, they can just bring it back. Oh, I took out the second Suprex. That's right. Two out of 31. I don't think there's any way to make it big enough. I've got time. That's going to speed up the clock. They just needed a monster. I, I gotta tell you, Bergram would be insane if it wasn't for the fact it could get banished. I'm just gonna bluff a card. They banish insect knights. I'm dead. If they don't, I live. How am I so good? How am I so good at this game? If I draw removal off the top, it's over. Okay. That's not good. Please. One time. Damn. We tried. Eternal soul. Eternal pain in my ass. God damn it, dude. Open the Tacaton board. Perfect. Cherubini. Oh my god. I'll see where this goes. Second Tacaton Borg. Man, we're still doing this, aren't we? This guy is coming straight out of 2020. 2021, whenever the fuck this was legal. All right, my Gamma Seal would be pretty nice about now. Gamma Seal. That is not Gamma Seal. I don't know if we can beat DPE. We'll try it. All right, we said everything in pray. <laughs> yeah, this is not going to work. I kind of wanted that one.
I kind of needed that. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> yeah, this is not happening. <laughs> we tried. We tried. DPE should just be an auto concede. There's just no chance. Unless we get Gamma Seal. Unless we get Gamma Seal. Wow. Am I actually going to get to pull this combo off for once? Five card extra decks promising. There's my Gamma Seal. Um, this is kind of annoying. I want to get the Camellia set up. Let's try Horn Needle. Damn, I gotta send Horn Needle to the grave more often. Holy shit. If that's why that's gonna go. Sure. All right, take what we can. Ooh, don't mind if I do. Stonehenge Methods, Chronomaly. Terrible. Flambell Baby. Warrock Skyler. Expendable Die. Funny if we had Warriors. That card's actually not terrible. Snapdragon. Very funny. Oh, it's a plant. Hold on. Oh, that card sucks. Damn it. That card sucks even more. We can't summon this. God, what I would do for a playable ultra rare. Punk card. If we were playing like a graveyard based deck, we could consider D5. Try to auto win against all the snake eye decks. That'd be funny. All right. Legacy packs. This looks promising. Xyz combine and Tantan. -tan. Wing Weaver Prisman. Not the Prisman. That's Gage's favorite card. Oh, we're going first. Place your bets on Lightning Storm incoming. Lightning Storm, Feather Duster. What are we feeling? What are we feeling? Oh! If I armored B and they have Kalut, I'm going to fucking cry. I actually think I'm going to do this. This lets me summon the Lab Archfiend, which is primarily what I wanted to do. It only drains attack. That's really funny. Okay, I don't know where this is going, but if this is all they're doing, we can go like summon armored B, have this, attack, attack, and then we're just in like full control. Is that a permanent attack loss? That's a per Oh no, end of this turn. Okay. God, imagine pulling like a bestial druis worm in Masochist. That would be actually just insane. All right, uh, we get in. This is kind of nasty, because if they try to kill the Armored Bee, we can Magic Cylinder to block, and then Armored Bee have and probably hit over it. <sighs> this doesn't do anything. Literally just how I said. Is this game? 900. And it buffs the Lab Archfiend, which is funny. 19 plus 16 is 35. I think it is like just barely off from being game. Game. 
I guess they could have a bestial. That's like the only thing I'm not accounting for here. Does Jerry have attack? It does not. Good thing I didn't try to do that. Okay. Oh, I guess I... Mm, that's annoying. I guess I could have summoned... Gary, attack, pop, and then attack, attack, attack. I guess I could have done that. And that would have been game. Steam the cloak. Double tuner. That doesn't do anything. Triple tuner. Are we just linking? Summon Blackwing Dragon. And yeah, whatever. Uh, is full armor master a 10 or is it 11? I think it's a 10. I'm pretty sure it's a 10. Well, they're making a 12. What the fuck is this? Cannot be destroyed by card effects. Blah, 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 blah. So it can adjust its level. So it could make itself a seven. If it makes itself a seven and then it can tune with steam to make full armor, they target. Armed wing? That's a six. Cool deck. This lab archfiend is swole. Holy yes! Oh my god. I'm like, the only way we lose this is that they summon full armor. That's the only way we lose that. I felt like I was way... Oh, wait. I forgot to open the pack. Shit. I was just so excited to get back into it. All right. We'll open one after this. It's fine. We're just going to win it back to back and have to open two. I'm just saving myself from going back. If I get a Camellia, this hand immediately becomes insane. Ah, uh, it's a real deck. I guess it's during the main phase. What do we get? Okay. What do they do? Just go Alibur? We cry. Yep, gotta do it here. Opted not to fuse. I just want to cut them off of everything. What is this, Max C? Max C incoming. Or not. Cartesia and a bunch of other nonsense. What if I just negate this? Fuck it. Do I want it? 36, 15? Sure. I don't think we're using Bear Grimm this game anyway. I'll take it. Keeps it out of their grave. I guess they just had another one. Do they play this? Dogmatic Calamity. That's a name. I don't think I've ever seen that card in my life. 
All right. Well, now they're just going to do everything. Maybe I should just let it go to grave. Let it go to grave. They couldn't fuse if they had another follow-up. End phase, get all your crap back. Yep. Get Cartesia back. Yeah, we're dead. If only we didn't get rid of the Bear Grum. Yeah, I should have just left that thing in grave. We go Camellia Send. Uh, we would have... Oh, no, they banished this, so we wouldn't be close anyway. Uh, that blows. I can't clear either of these. Oh yeah, the whore needle's gone. Actually kind of wanted that. Oh well. I don't know what they're thinking about. Whatever. I've, I'm, I've wasted enough time on this. So guys, that's going to wrap it up for another video. I really hope you all enjoy. Let's go ahead and shout the patrons for all of their continued support. So shout to Shout1317, Tim00x3, MBT Play Medolce, Moto, Cameron L. Smith, Phoenix the Immortal, Pony Stark, The Synchro Guy, Dan the Man Hoban, Little Fade Leaf, Draconic, Dylan Rare Hunter, JW11860, Extremely Vulgar Man, Brody Eastwood, Flannel Daddy, Chrono the Branded Enjoyer, Twinkle Muncher, Matthew Brady, Uncle Brian of Stardust, Power Rave, but without a stupidly long name that barely makes any sense and is annoying to read out loud, Cheeks McLapperty, Stolfin Amethyst, Wonder Waffle, MBT cancel by all community soon, cancel by all committee soon, cancel by all players soon, Nicholas Carpenter, Corvain, Calvin Tempest, RIP Akira Toriyama, Daniel Howell, and life keeps using solemn judgment on my hopes and dreams. Thank you all so much for watching, and we will see you next time.